this was the way the championship night ended, with the trophy being held high. How the Raiders earned that trophy is quite a story. Before getting to the title game, Q&D had to get past Hoffman Estates, a team ranked first in the state for most of the year. Senior Mark Thomas put his team in front with this goal in the first quarter. That goal by Thomas stood up until the fourth quarter when Hoffman Estates tied it up. And after regulation time, it was 1-1. Another overtime game. And after last year's championship game loss after eight overtimes, you could see the Raiders' determination not to fall short again. Again, Mark Thomas came through. This goal in the first overtime gave the Raiders the win, and it sent them into the finals for the second straight year. There, they met Collinsville in an all-downstate soccer final. After getting behind early, again, all-stater Mark Thomas delivered. That goal made it one to one, and it stayed that way until the final two minutes of the season. Here's the championship winning goal Kevin Ketters to Johnny Pro. Well, it's the same thing that's been uh, going on the whole night, and it's been going on that way the whole season. Whenever he gets a free kick or a corner kick like that where he's going to chip it in, he always tells me he's going to kick it to me and that we're going to score on it. And he's been telling me that the whole game. And uh, that's all I was thinking about, give me the ball, I want to put it in. And he did, and we did. Well, uh, I uh, said about three Hail Marys when Kevin set it up, but I, I honestly felt, and, and maybe it was just supposed to happen, but John is our best head shooter on the team or header and I felt if Kevin got the ball to where John could handle it it was going to be a goal and like John uh, said it uh, there was no question in his mind once it left his head that it was going in the left corner and oh that was one of the prettiest goals I've ever seen. With all the suspense of a Hitchcock thriller, the QND Raiders had finished off what they almost did last year, a state championship. And this is the first boys state championship in the long, very successful athletic history at Quincy Notre Dame. It feels great. Last year was kind of a disappointment coming back and getting second, but we knew last year we'd be tough and we could, you know, go and get the goal this year. I'll cherish it for a long time. Uh, this medal around my neck. Uh, I love this thing. Um, I'll cherish hanging on my wall. The weather was bad. The field conditions were terrible. But yesterday was a beautiful day for boys to be boys and some men to be boys too. The Quincy Notre Dame Raiders have brought home the gold. They are the 1985 Illinois State Soccer Champions. Congratulations. Steve Luton, Newswatch Sports.